Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dadak, and today we're playing some more Mind Industry. So, in our last episode, we started. I can't even remember what map we're on. Fungal Pass. We started this one. Why is that red? Hmm. Anyway, yes, we started Fungal Pass, and it's one that's based on troop control, which I'm not used to doing. Ah, get away with you. We're just going to wait for this group of units to come in. Then we're going to rip out this copper mine that we've got right here. Oh, they are actually nailing me. There we go. Right, I want to take this out quickly. Because I want to get some bigger drills in here. Um, um, go like that, three would be there, go like that, anybody want to guess why I'm going for three? Yep, because I can do that, and actually, if I just do that right there, because we weren't quite getting enough copper in, now we should be getting a ridiculous amount of copper in. Yeah, that's much better. And it's managing to hold. Plus, when these start stalling out, the water will fill up even quicker. So, happy days there. I need to stop using the line of these as much, don't I? Yeah, that's better. How are my units doing? My units have been decimated. God damn it. Fall back. We definitely need to make our next choke point. Right, have these gone past? Kind of, yeah. We did wreck. Ah, these, they are anti-air, though. I can make my next choke point right here. So, let me tuck a few doors in. I mean, we can build into the water. There's nothing stopping us. Oh, steady on there, sunshine. Go like that and like this. I think I want to go for energy weapons next. I'm not going to be able to get all this built in time, is the thing. Two, three, let's go like that, and then we can get water tanks in the middle. And then it's all about bringing pipes and power up here. That's, does that reach? That doesn't reach either. Wait, that, that does actually reach? Wait a minute, I've not actually got to... Yeah. I've not actually got to get water up there. We're, we're in a lake, genius. Admittedly, I'm going to have to protect the water. Could we get some of the lancers up, please, so you can at least try and defend? They have got power. They're just going to destroy all of this. It's fine. A wall of lancers is better than no defense at all, though. At least we've got a chance of protecting it. I'm fine with them flying straight over. They did die, didn't they? Yeah. We d we didn't really want explosive units coming in then. That was just silly. Oh, I was about to say they've got some big boys. Didn't really do them very well though, did it? Couple of those in there. Couple of those in there. Go like that. It's probably going to be safer to bring water up from further back. But honestly, I can do something like this as well. 
Let's get rid of one of these. Have a mender project in here. I don't know what's with this storm. Mender project, please. That will cover the entire thing as well. Take that out first. Build that. There we go. Now, build this one. So we've got an next choke point. I could build some scatters down here, honestly. That'd be fine. Um, if I take them out there, can I get water through this bit? Because that'd be dead cool. So they're going to come straight down to these doors, obviously. Which I should really take a couple of these lances out and probably try and protect it down the side a little bit. Can't get a water tank in there. Oh, it's one tile too long. Well, to be honest with you. I did kind of make a slight boo-boo there. If this comes out one further, then I can just bring the lancers up this side as well. And then we've got our in-house water anyway. Plus we've not got two little bits across there as well. So the little bits always annoy me. If we can avoid them, I'll try and avoid them. This episode we should absolutely be pushing for a victory. Um, get rid of all these. Probably get rid of this back one. And these are going to come up this way like this. Still going to leave these down here. There's no reason to get rid. Honestly, there's no reason to get rid of that one. It's still going to be connected to what it, there is. No, there isn't. I can snake it around. Nope, it has got to go. No, it's not. Slap that there. Just go something like that. Steady on there, guys. Steady on there. Holy Christ. Right, that's going to give all them water. There you go, you guys have some water as well. How about we have a few smaller mender ones? Yeah, that's going to take a long time to fill up. Well, if that's not having turrets there, it might as well just have a liquid tank. There we go. Now that's pulling water in better. Cool. Proper defense. And command center. All the way up here. Are you alright down there, Luna? Oh yeah. You probably shouldn't fly away from it when you were um, trying to sort it out. How are we doing for power? Yeah, I'll be fine to do this. That'll be enough. It's only for some scatters. Just because I'm sick of them attacking between. And honestly, I, th I was going to go up. I think I'm just going to build a line straight through the middle like this. What are you doing, you fool? It's fine. That'll work. And we can copy this. Go there. That's the one. Yeah, how are you guys doing up there? You're you alright? You, you're not making it through the wall? Yeah, I didn't think so. Didn't think so. Yeah, I thought each thing could hold up to... Sixteen, but that's not how it works. You can make a maximum of sixteen units. 
I mean, really, I could grab this and duplicate it on the back. You do seem to get one extra out of each other one, but... Yeah. yeah, we need to get it pushing. These waves are going to start hurting soon. There you go. And uh, this command center's the end done. I guess this is where I should really get graphite coming in. Because honestly, if I did... A couple of them. Did they literally just fly past everything? Because I've not got any turrets... Yeah, let's um, let's get a bit of water coming down from here. God damn it. I'm going to need water across where that is anyway. And we can have liquid router right there and one coming in right there as well. There's currently no liquid coming down this way because I'd not flipping fixed it up properly. Genius plays. Now I need more of these. Can't build any more in there. Really not pulling that much water in at a time. I could always destroy this now, but I don't want to just in case it goes badly. Uh, laser drills are fine. Let's try these new multi presses. Mm -mm -mm. If I have water coming in the bottom of these two, like this, boom, boom. This can jump across there. I don't even think this needs that one. This needs a router before, doesn't it? But it looks like it's coming out there. That is annoying how that works. Anyway. So we've got graphite coming out of there. We needed silicon and graphite, didn't we? That makes it marginally more difficult. So I was going to try and get this additive reconstructor built up. Just come away from the wall a bit. Can you all rally up to this one? Fair enough, we've got to move our command point. That's fine. I should probably move the repair points as well. Just in case I get battered, because that does tend to keep happening. Yoink. Just want to see if we can get them upgraded. If we can't, then fair enough. Um, yeah, that needs 40 silicon. I mean, there's nothing stopping me doing that there. We can get sand, we can get coal. Just slap it there. Give me a overflow. You go like that. How much silicon have I set up on this map, for God's sake? I was going to try for four there, but obviously I kind of can't. They can go like that. No, this needs to go the other way around. Water needs to jump over that. please. <clears throat> right, now I've got silicon. We will get this working. 
You can come up here like this. Um, guys, you seem to be all stood. You know what? Attack. Uh, where am I getting the coal from there? I'm getting coal from before that. I'm getting coal from there. You keep going like that. Oh, these are meant to be going this way, you stupid. This should work now. Obviously. And you need to come across here like this. And we just need a router there, router there, and a junction there, there. And then you can come in, you can go like that, you can go like that. You guys, come back. Now, how does this work? Have you got to get the troops to go in it? Or what? It looks like you've got to get them to go in it, doesn't it? So that would mean... I could do it with the flying units, I think. Again, just, just trying this. Go like that, go like that. So that just needs silicon. That just needs silicon. Guys, go attack because you're in my way. I'm still getting bits of coal on here. Go router. I wonder. Are these units now going to start going straight into there and being upgraded? Or have they got to go into the back of this? Like that. Maybe they've got to go like that. That would make more sense. Come on, just wait a minute. <gasps> Why am I getting coal on here? That's an overflow gate. That can't be an overflow gate. I mean, it can. There's no real reason for it to be an overflow gate. Do that and do that. And then it comes off in both directions anyway. Christ. Ah. Please tell me it's fixed it. Yeah, it's fixed it. Get it all on one straight line, and bam. You go away. I bet we're close to having beat this level now. Or not. Come on. There we go. Um, guys, come back. 
we've we've not really got any um any forces at the minute. Why are you stood there, my dude? Well, you're being locked up. See, they're being pushed into there. That one's worked. Ooh. Flare, we've got horizons there. So I definitely know for future that I don't need to make multiple things that make troops. How are we doing, by the way, pushing into their base? We've kind of got stuck around here. Once the scatters have gone, we'll be fine. Can I just... Oh, it's a bomber unit. This is dead cool. Probably not dead cool flying in a line around the enemy like that, but... Why do they keep going directly for this? I mean, it's brilliant for this turret right here because it's just lacing straight through all of them. Oh, it's because they're shooting straight for me, aren't they? The... Yeah, that is awesome. Can we... Attack. They fly so much faster than the, the bomber units do. They were literally going for the, the thing in the middle. That's probably not the, the way to play it, my dudes. Why are these not going anywhere? It is very weird. Excuse me. Could, could you stop that? Thank you. Thank you. Come on, you can come in. Oh, it's the deep water. That's why they don't really enjoy life at the minute. Uh, that's why my units aren't getting through. Possibly not the best bottleneck ever thought of. Just want to see if it's deep water underneath this tile. Not really, no. Right, destroy this one. Dudes, you need to move. Go attack, if you're going to sit in my way. That needs to go there. That needs to go there. This needs to come out. And door needs to go there. Oh, we've won. Okay, then. Go attack. Yep, you keep telling me about the wave turrets. <laughs> they don't really like this bit, do they? Let's take these walls out here so they can actually push in. Oh, they're not pushing in because they don't know where to push into anymore because these guys are deaded. Okay, then. Well, that's wonderful. Planet map. Let's go back to Steven's sector. Let's go. How we doing? Nearly got 9k of everything at the minute. Right, research. What have we unlocked? I'm sure some of these need a fungal pass across the top. Really? I should really start using shock mines, to be honest with you. Um, I see nothing. So we've got the dagger that evolves into the mace or the nova. And then it goes into the pulser. Naval factory, I mean, I'll unlock. I wonder if we can make our own titans. 
I need more coal coming in for this. I don't know why I've not got coal coming in, to be honest with you. What do we need then? Salt flats. I remember that being a huge level. Have I literally got no coal coming in here at all? Just for the sake of us having some coal coming in. Um, th there's no really decent way to do this, so I'm just going to go like that. There we go. That'll get them some coal coming in. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do a proper map next time. Although, if we can go to salt flaps... Where is that? We can't... We've got to do windswept islands. Ah, they're ready for any me bases. I see, I see. We've got to complete plastanium windswept islands. It's right there. We'll do this one next time then. We will keep going with the story for now. You never know, one of these with an enemy base might end up being nicer. And to be fair, I can launch into these. But if I launch into these and it's not... Um, if I launch into one of these and it's not great, we're just going to lose resources for the sake of losing resources. And I'd rather not do that, honestly. We'd rather not do that. So yeah, we've not been to the craters yet either, have we? Yeah, we have. That's why it says go. Windswept Island. That's what we'll do next time. Stick with the story. We've got plenty of this to go. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be fine with that. Cool. Well, a little bit of a shorter episode, which makes up for the mega massive long episodes that I keep doing. So, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more comments and feedback. Greatly appreciated, as always. And in the description below is a few links if you'd like to take a look. Most important one being the community Discord, where you can watch these episodes live as they're being recorded. And you can give me tips and point out mistakes I've made as we're going as well, which is dead useful for episodes. Stops me from uh, looking silly. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.